MakerBot just announced the winners of the Make It Loud Challenge, which was a contest to design something extremely loud. Uh, I thought it would be cool to do a video to print off the winner and compare it to something else. There's really no scientific reason or no expected result to come out of this, other than I just thought it would be fun. So, the winner for this contest was this whistle here. I 3D printed this, downloaded the files, you can find the files down below. This actually has a really cool pattern while it's printing. The internals of it aren't straight like a normal whistle. It's a kind of a maze in there. It's really cool. And I'm going to compare that with the standard 3D printed whistle. This is just what you would get from a dollar store, except I 3D printed it. Very nice file. Clean print. I also downloaded an app, a decibel meter app so that we can test and compare. So what I'll do is I'll blow first the regular one and show you the results and then the contest winner and show you the results. I'm also going to clip the audio down on the whistles so I don't blow out your eardrums. Let's do it. Okay, so up first we have this regular printed whistle. Um, pretty much what you would get from a dollar store. Beautiful design. Again, the link is below. So here we go. I'm turning on the decibel meter. I hope you can see this. And here we go. Pretty loud. I didn't get to see the peak because it was facing the camera, but I'll compare it later. Okay, now for the contest winner. You'll hear that it sounds quite different. Here we go. <sighs> wow, man, that's loud. I think I maxed this thing out. At least it goes to the top of the chart and kind of bounces around there. Okay, I reviewed the video and I can see that they're only just a few decibels apart. There are a few things to consider. My room, uh, the measuring app that I'm using may not be that accurate. It only maxes out at 110 decibels and this whistle MakerBot measured to be at 118. So there's lots of reasons that they could be similar in loudness. But what I think a major contributing factor to the perceived loudness, at least for me, was this is actually two whistles in one. They're slightly off tone, so they kind of resonate off of each other and vibrate in your brain, and it just sounds incredibly loud. It's like somebody's blowing two whistles next to you instead of one. So they may be similar in sound and practice, uh, I mean in, in decibel level and practice, but this one certainly sounds louder. What a fun little contest.